Hello, it's a pleasure for me to address the EGM students and the representatives of Dutch political youth organizations that came together for this meeting of young minds. I'm speaking in my capacity as a chairman of STOA, the Scientific Technology Options Assessment, which is a reference point for science and technology advice for the committees and members of the European Parliament. As such, it carries out technology assessment projects in all areas of science and technology. One of these projects, entitled Making Perfect Life, aims at gaining an insight into the revolution uh, made in bioengineering and the resulting political and ethical challenges. As part of these projects, STUA is organizing a workshop on the 11th of October 2011 in Brussels. Synthetic biology will be a revolution in the biotechnology industry and will have an impact on fields such as energy, health, medicine and the environment. In the coming decades, the wave of bioengineering developments will have a huge impact on European states and citizens. Synthetic biology has been covered by the media and research in this area and this has been funded with more than uh, 50 million euro by European Union under the research framework program. It was relatively recently, however, uh, that it began to attract public and regulatory attention. In this context, the European group and especially the ethics of science uh, and new technologies issued two years ago an opinion on the implications of synthetic biology, in which it calls, among others, for the promotion of public dialogue in this area. The meeting of young minds is a timely public dialogue uh, between communities and young scientists and politicians. Uh, synthetic biology concerns primarily the future of these young people. Allow me to conclude by wishing you a lot of success in your important work. STOA will follow closely your activities and will look forward to hearing about your achievements. We are there uh, to support you and hopefully we see you soon with good results. Thank you so much. All the best from the European Parliament.